volunteers. <laughs> An emotional return to Checkpoint Charlie for former U.S. soldier William Gunther. He was posted in Germany in the 1970s. It's his first trip back since then, but he remembers the fall of the Berlin Wall like it was yesterday. A friend called me. I live way up in the mountains on a remote place. He called. I drove 20 miles to his house where he has television, and I saw people dancing on the, on the Brandenburg Gate. I just thought, yes, yes, freedom, freedom for the East. It meant so much to me. 25 years after the collapse of the wall, Checkpoint Charlie, an infamous crossing point between East and West Berlin, stands as a reminder of a city split into two by ideology and a concrete barrier. Our daughter was only one years old when the wall was being built. It was very dramatic. It was terrible. Everyone cried. They waved from over there and we waved back. We are so happy that it turned out so well and that everything is open again. More than 130 people were killed trying to escape to West Berlin and many more who were captured ended up in jail. The fall of the wall signaled an end to the Cold War and led to a reunified Germany.